I grew up in uh, Alexandra Township, a township just outside of Johannesburg. And I recall uh, that we had a, a, a cinema there, uh, which, to which we went almost every weekend. And most of the films that we saw were American movies, mainly uh, cowboy Indian uh, type uh, movies. Yeah, I was. I, I grew up in Alexandra, and in Alexandra we had a cinema, which we went to almost every weekend. Most of the movies that they showed there were uh, cowboy movies, uh, Indians and cowboys. Now and then, occasionally there would be, you know, uh, religious movies and things like that. I think that um, those movies in the first instance, uh, portrayed to us what the West is. We saw uh, what America is or what Western civilization is through those movies. But also because um, Western civilization was something that which one had to uh, aspire towards. So it is according to that that we tried to become westernized, if you want to say that. Uh, and the result, I think, is that uh, precisely because it were what I would call bang bang type uh, movies, uh, they served to fuel a lot of uh, gangsterism amongst our midst. Uh, we always aspired to be the the uh, stirrings in those films. I remember people like Gene Autry, John Wayne, Tarzan, etc. Uh, this, is, this is very curious in the sense that once I left Alexandra and I went to the US, it became very difficult for me to distinguish between real American life and the movies. First of all, one saw uh, what one had. Uh, American twang, very familiar, but one had only seen it and witnessed it through the through the screen. And then, of course, uh, being in New York, one looked at the police and one couldn't differentiate between them and the cowboys. Uh, and many other things which one can talk about, especially if one arrives in the U.S. very conscious of uh, racism coming from an apartheid country. Uh, it's very easy that you feel that uh, you are once more reliving, you know, uh, uh, the cowboy Indian films, but this time in, you know, instead of horses and cows, you are using cars and there are traffic lights, but you feel threatened in the same way that I, I would think the Indians were threatened. So to a certain extent, uh, this is the image that one would have of uh, the West, uh, besides the glitter which other films showed, besides the dream that uh, you know uh, it is possible to be to acquire fortune, it is possible to become famous, it is possible to live in a world that is extremely wealthy. There was that part too. 